are you looking to build an awesome dream home cinema room of yours well in that case i am going to share with you the main four things that are no compromise while designing home cinema room and just to ensure that these are followed make sure to send this video with your designers and architects so that they can take care of all these four requirements while you go out there to make decisions on the speakers and the amplifiers and with that let me introduce myself hello everyone my name is tanmay mehta your home cinema consultant or home theater wale bhaiya and since last 9 years we have been designing home cinema rooms as well as home cinema systems for our customers across india and during or while interacting with these people we realized that there is so much of lack of awareness while buying home theater systems that people cannot make the right choices and right decisions and for that very reason this channel of ours is a mission wherein we want you to get all that required information so that you can make well informed wise and correct decisions when it comes to buying anything to everything in the home cinema space now obviously cause we are going to talk about home theater system and to in today's video we are going to talk about home cinema room i cannot sit here so let's go and check out the main four things that are no compromise while designing the home cinema room the first thing that you need to keep in mind while designing a home cinema room is to have a room which has got dark ambiance now this is very important in home cinema rooms because when you are sitting on this chairs you need to have a engrossed vision into the movie so that you can feel that as if you are a part of that movie and to do that you need to treat the walls with darker colors so that there is no distraction or very less reflection of light happening from any of the surfaces so right from your roof to the walls to the floor everything needs to be either treated by acoustics with finishes of darker shades which is obviously more important but at the same time the finish of the paint also if you are going to put a direct wall then that also has to be with darker colors the second thing that you need to keep in mind while designing a home cinema room is to have minimum and indirect light now indirect lighting can obviously be in warmer colors so something which is between 3000 to 5000 kelvin works pretty well in home cinema room and at the same time it has to be indirect so what do i mean by indirect so as you can see right behind me there are panels which are hiding the strip lights so these indirect lights will not cause a direct glare to your eyes and you can have only two or four spotlights in the ceiling so that if at all the room needs to be treated or you need to clean it you would need some light so for that you can keep some direct lights but the main lighting in the theater room has to be minimum and it has to be indirect you can also use color shades cause color shades do act and give a different feeling altogether into the room and the bonus treat to this lighting is when you treat the ceiling with star lighting now star lighting gives an amazing experience wherein you feel that you are watching movie under stars and these lights keep on twinkling so they work on a method called fiber optics so make sure to do that in your theater room third thing that you need to keep in mind while designing home cinema room is to take care of the setting now the setting can be in terms of bean bags sofas or recliners but having them comfortable is very very important so that you can focus on the movie than concentrating on the uneasiness that the chair or the setting would cause you so make sure to have a setting combination of sofas and recliners and bean bags by which you can actually get involved into the movie and get rid of all the problems that the setting would cause you the fourth and the final thing that needs no compromise at all while designing home cinema room is any guesses well obviously the av system this is one of my most favorite part the reason being the av system has got enough power and enough juice wherein it can actually take you to a whole different world and for that to happen you need a very well calculated a very well calibrated and the right choice of equipments in the cinema room so in the list of av equipments what all things are there well you have got the screen then there has to be a projector there has to be speakers a great choice of speakers there has to be a good powerful thumping bass and there has to be amplification which has got enough power to drive all the systems and at the same time there has to be media players which can give a fantastic content streaming options for all of you 
and to connect all these things the cables and accessories now all this put together are comprised in the fourth option which again needs no compromise at all so just to summarize the four main things that needs no compromise while designing home cinema room number one is the dark ambience of the room second one is minimum and indirect light with warm colors third thing is comfortable chairs and fourth point is the right choice of av equipments now if all of these things made sense to all of you then do hit the like button and share this video with your designers so that they make no mistake for your dream home cinema room while you go out there and shop for the right system now in case you need my team's help to design your home theater room then do check the link in the description and i tanmay mehta your home cinema consultant or home theater wale bhaiya will see you again in the next video thank you भाई देव अगर आपको ये नया फॉर्मेट अच्छा लगा हो तो कमेंट बॉक्स में जरूर बताइएगा ताकि हम लोग आपके लिए और ऐसे ही कुछ एक्सपेरिमेंट्स कर सके आई नो हिंदी वीडियोस जरूर आएंगे